So now, for space 3, you need to open space 2 and navigate to insert a new slide between slides 4 here and 5. So I go to slide 4, go to the home, put a new title and content slide in, and that goes neatly between slides 4 and 5. There's nothing on this slide, but the instructions tell us to put in first landings as the title and then we're going to type in those people who were in Apollo 11 so the people in Apollo 11 were Neil Armstrong Buzz Aldrin and Michael Collins we also have Apollo 12 less well-known Charles Conrad and always useful for a quiz and Richard Gordon what we're going to do here is we're going to now select the names we're going to use this button here which increases the list level and you can see that they get increased there that's a much better layout and as we'll see in a moment when we fly them in if we can fly those individually so the slide now makes a bit more sense. We now want to put some transitions between our slides. So we go to slide sorter, select all our slides and go to transitions. The transition that we're looking for here is called blinds, horizontal. There it is, blinds, and the effect option we want is horizontal, not vertical. So as you can see, we get vertical blinds coming in between each of the slides. We get a little preview. Once we've done blinds horizontal, we're going to fly all our bullet points in. Now we could do this individually by adding animations to each slide, but once again, it's quite good to go to view slide master select the main slide this time so that everything flies in select the bullet points and here we can animate with a fly in option from the left so we're flying in from the left we'll see that the number one appears here because they're going, going to fly in together I quite like to go to the animation pane at this point and right click and do start on click and you'll see that the bullet levels come in individually we can close the slide master there it is and if we go to this slide here and play it we will see that when I click the button they fly in individually which is great The final thing that we need to do is go to the last slide called Phases of the Moon and here we're going to insert three pictures. The first picture is a crescent moon which I'm inserting there. Okay, Let's leave it as it is, Just move it and then we don't want to resize it like I did insert the next picture which is the half moon and then finally we want to insert the full moon for the moment we just want them in that order but you notice over here you get design ideas and powerpoint might give you some options we'll leave those for the minute because what we're going to do now is select each one go to animation and add fly in from the left so the crescent moon first 
flying from left and then here flying from left always remember that we've added a new slide called landing called first landings so I'm going to the content slide and making sure that I've got first landings in there and then I can save my file as space 3 that task's now all done